This is something I've been wanting to do for a long time. We are proud to announce that the Water Jet Channel is getting involved in the custom knifery. Here we've got some premium cuts of knife steel. This is 1080 and then this is 1095. Both those are high carbon steels and they are prime for some knifing. Very prime. I mean, cause as it stands, this is like not that stabby. It's probably like a one or a two out of 10. I mean, not bad. Maybe it's even a three on the corners. Yeah. We're gonna try to make it into a four or five. <laughs> <laughs> Water jets make knife, knife making really easy. Not, not easy necessarily. It's a preferred method for cutting out knife blanks because it, it doesn't generate any heat really. And so we want to use our water jet to cut out some nice knives and then uh, we'll see what our first attempt looks like. I mean, it might, it might be pretty pathetic, but... And just like that, I think we hit a four or five on the stabby. What should we take it up to now? Um, see if you can get it to an eight. Yeah, more, more stabby. Now we've got a bunch of designs done. It's grinding time. Well, after about 20 minutes, I'm already given up on sanding. There's still a lot of deep marks in that, as you can tell. It, surface grinder would make this so much easier. I'm actually pretty happy with how that's turning out. This side looks a lot more uniform than this side. This side's got like more of a smiley and I, I couldn't figure out what I was doing that was causing that. This side's a lot less so, but I mean, that's still pretty good. Better than I thought it was gonna be for my first attempt. only took me 74 hours but I finally made a knife you better be kidding <laughs>
I don't think I am. <laughs> Look at that. Ah. This is what I came up with. Do not make fun of how not straight those lines are. Does this side look better? Nope, they're both pretty bad. It's decently sharp, but I still don't have a furnace, so it's still not hardened and it loses its edge really quickly. I'd say that's pretty good. For a noob. I tried to do a mirror finish first and then it started to look really bad. And so then I had to go back and try and rough it up and now it almost looks worse than before. <laughs> so now I'm gonna try to make a knife and see if my first attempt <laughs> looks better than yours. <laughs> You're looking for that. We'll see who did it better. But I'm definitely gonna continue trying to make knives. I wanna get better at this. Cause even this as like kinda ugly as it is, it's it's still kinda cool. Like it I'll makes you wanna stab somebody, right? Like I always want to do that though. So, that's... <laughs> so we wanted to use the resources available to us like a wetter, wetter jet. We even bought a very old surface grinder that still works. And we want to make it possible for um, you guys or anybody to start making knives. If you don't have a bandsaw, if you don't have an angle grinder, that's okay. Um, you can go to our website, you can pick one of our designs. In the future, we're gonna allow you to submit a design. Um, we'll cut out the knife of the steel that you want. We'll send it to you, and then all you've gotta do is file it and sand it for 82 hours on your first one, and then 40 on your second, and probably like 20 on yeah, your third. Yeah, you'll get it down to like an hour or two. Also, on our website, we are including an option to buy a knife blank in just mild steel if you want to practice doing different types of grinds on a blade if you want to do practice doing like a, a nightmare grind or something like that um don't do it on super expensive knife steel do it on super cheap mild steel and then you can practice that way so go to waterjetknives.com we'll have a link down in the description check it out this week well this weekend is our grand opening and so to celebrate we're gonna set up a promo code if you're buying two or more items you'll get 20 percent off so you could buy a mild steel practice blank and then your one that you're gonna try really hard on in whatever other steel that you want that's two items you'll get 20 percent off that way nothing's gonna change here on the water jet channel we're still gonna be up to our same old shenanigans uh, but occasionally you're gonna see some progress on knives uh, and you can always go to waterjetknives.com uh, to check out our latest products uh, or sign up for our email list to get notifications uh, or check us out on instagram our new waterjet knives instagram uh, so I hope to see you in all of those places.